Hey guys, how y'all doing? My name is Echo and welcome to another episode on my Minecraft Title Update 19 question and answer series. Now if you're new to my channel, this series is where I answer your questions from the comments section, from Twitter, Facebook, etc. So if you have any questions regarding Title Update 19, all you need to do is leave a comment down below and I could be answering your question next week. Now it's been about two weeks since I did an episode of this, I do apologise for that. And since these two weeks we've had some great questions and we've also had some great news from voice shows, information, screenshots, you name it. So I'm going to be covering as many questions in this episode. As always, if you do enjoy it and you'd like to see more episodes, be sure to hit that like button because I really do appreciate the support. Nonetheless, let's go. These questions are what have been given to me over the space of two weeks. So the first question I was given says, do you think we'll be getting stained glass? Now this question is asked towards me every single episode in the comments section and I have tried to avoid it because I did think in the past we possibly could have seen it. Now we know that Minecraft Console Edition is being updated to the Java version 1.6.4. This is the rest of the pretty scary update features, the wither with skeletons etc. We're going to be getting the redstone update and we're also going to be getting the horse update as well. We've seen plenty of these screenshots over and over over the past month and a half. Now the reason why I don't think stained glass is coming is because it was introduced to Minecraft PC in 1.7.2 so I kind of feel that this edition is out of the adept for title update 19 and I think it's something that 40 years would want the community to look forward to in the future but it is a great edition I would love to see it in title update 19 but remember not everything will be coming in this update. So moving on from that the next question we have says the new screenshot from Voice Heroes shows all consoles in the same spot. What does this mean? Now the image that you can see on screen right now is the picture that we was given on Friday. If you look closely at all of the additions, even PSV to Minecraft, they are all standing in the same location. Now a lot of you have been saying, does this mean like cross-platform saves? I don't think it is. I generally just think it was just the same seed and Voice Heroes wanted to make sure it looks exactly the same across all platforms. I could be wrong. I could be completely wrong. But that's just my opinion on this. Uh, a few of you did ask me that on Twitter and I just thought it was definitely worth clearing up in this video. So the next one, and I knew this was going to be asked towards me, it says, So manual crafting is coming to title update 19 for fireworks, but do you think we'll be getting a possible manual crafting for everything in the future? In the future? Now if you look at this picture right here, this confirms that manual crafting is coming to Minecraft, uh, Xbox, PlayStation, etc. Before series have confirmed by saying that's just a fireworks crafting UI. Now the reason why it's only for fireworks is because there's so many different combinations with the fireworks and the fireworks stars that they had to introduce something kind of manual. Now I don't know if they're ever going to introduce manual crafting to the console edition but I would love to see manual crafting and automatic crafting side by side. This would be a great addition. I know it's easier said than done and the amount of coding that four years would have to do but we have talked about this in the past, I think it will be a great feature to be introduced. At least manual crafting is coming for the fireworks and that is a massive bonus in my opinion. It means that you can craft what you want, it may be a little bit uneasy at first and getting used to it may take a little time but yes, manual crafting is coming in Title Update 19. I don't think in the future anytime soon it will be available for all features but maybe in the far future after all updates are available on console it can be something voice shows can adventure into. Um, so yeah, that was a great question. Thank you very much. So the next one says, when do you think we'll be getting more players per world like they promised on release? Now this is a great question because remember, the first time we heard that Minecraft Xbox One and PlayStation 4 was getting Minecraft, a lot of people was like, well, is it mean more players? And Voice Zero said yes. It was like 10 or 12 people, possibly more. Um, and ever since that, we've never really had any news regarding more players per world. It is still 8 on Xbox One and PlayStation 4. And it is well ca capable of holding up to 16, maybe even more players per world. And I would love to see this feature. The only thing I can think of is when they do introduce servers and realms, this is when we'll see more players. And I am confident servers and realms will be coming in the future edition versions of Minecraft. Um, but I don't think in Title Update 19 we'll be getting more players. It's more about the features than anything else such as items with the boss horses etc but I like that question nonetheless I do appreciate that so this question was also left on my Instagram I said uh, do you think there will be a new tutorial mode and if so how much do you think it will change now I'm pretty confident in, in fact I'm 
pretty much 100% confident that Title Update 19 is going to introduce a new tutorial mode. I don't know if they're going to completely change the tutorial mode, but they're going to have to introduce a new tutorial mode um, features because a lot of features that are coming in Title Update 19, a lot of people don't know how to use them. They've never played Minecraft PC before. So these features, they are very, very confused about. So yes, I am thinking a brand new tutorial mode will be coming. And I don't know how much they're going to change it, but I just, I'm so confident that new tutorial mode will be coming. Also, they like to hide the easter eggs. Is it the um, the music discs? They like to hide them all over the world. At the moment, I believe the tutorial mode is of Edinburgh Castle, which is great because uh, voice heroes are based in Scotland as it is. Um, so the question here we have, do you think any console exclusive features will be coming? Well, fireworks is going to be manual crafting for console, so that's kind of an exclusive. I don't know what you mean by exclusive, it could be that we get some more uh, host privileges. Remember we've got fly and teleport, which I think are very useful. Um, I would love to see a few more um, like commands for the host. Maybe, I don't know, some other cool ones that you guys can probably think of. Um, as of any exclusive blocks or items, I don't think any exclusive blocks or items will be coming. But possibly in the near future and maybe other updates as well. So yeah, I don't think any console exclusives are coming specifically unless Voice Heroes want to announce them. Because basically, I kind of feel they haven't given us all the images uh, or all the features so far. So the next one says, we haven't seen any stained clay pictures. Do you think they'll be coming? Now I am confident Stain Clay will be coming because Stain Clay was introduced to Minecraft PC in 1.6.4 and the console edition is being updated to 1.6 point, uh, sorry, and this feature came in 1.6.1. So I'm, I've got a little insight here guys, remember we did see the new biome screenshot, I kind of think Voice Heroes are holding off Stained Clay for a very special picture and in the picture they're going to be showing us Mesa Biomes which obviously is where Stained Clay is from as well so I think once they do show stained clay it's going to be the confirmation of new biomes which I kind of think they're going to hold out for as long as possible and um, which yeah I guess I'm hoping to see the update in the early 2015 January or February I'd be excited about that if it was earlier I'd be even more excited because it would be great to have it for Christmas time for everyone and to enjoy while they was off and um, so yeah thank you for that question it was great so another one here says I want hardcore mode how come we never got this? Now this is an awesome question, I would love to see Hardcore Mode and I kind of feel a possible chance of Hardcore Mode being introduced in Title Update 19 because this is going to be the first update for Xbox One and PlayStation 4 and PS Vita and obviously it's coming for the other consoles as well but this will be the first specific update for Xbox One and PlayStation 4. And I think that Hardcore Mode wasn't introduced because of how much RAM was on 360 and PlayStation 3. So Hardcore Mode is kind of like a 50-50 in my mind. I, I don't know why we never ever got it. I don't know why they didn't introduce it to Console Edition. I understand why they didn't introduce Adventure Mode because you need commands. But Hardcore Mode, it's simply once you're dead, the game is over. I don't know why they can't do that. I think they should do that. And I'm sure you guys would agree with me right there as well. So another question was, hey Echo, do you think they'll add a special feature on console to spawn undead and skeleton features, uh, featured horses or maybe a spawn egg. Now this is a great one and I have done a video specifically on the undead and skeleton horses but we never really had any information about these. We know horses, mules and donkeys are coming to title update 19 but we don't know about the undead skeleton uh, horses because obviously they need to be spawned with command blocks. 40 shows could possibly introduce a spawn egg for them and I do hope to the bottom of my heart they introduce the undead and the skeleton horse because it's so fun to mess around with them. Even if they only introduce them to creative it would be a cool addition to have. Um, so yeah I, I really hope so. I don't know if they will but I really hope that they do in, uh, introduce it. So the last question here was, will we be getting new foliage, plants, tall grass, uh, flowers, etc? I am confident that we will because we have seen a few screenshots of new biomes. Um, I believe some of them did like introduce uh, tall grass. And if they're going to introduce tall grass, they're going to be introducing new flower additions as well. I'm confident about that and I can say I hope so. Because if we get new biomes, they're going to be introducing all the features that come with the biomes as well. So guys, this has been another episode on my q and I do appreciate the support on this series and all you need to do to show your support towards me is leave a like because I appreciate that so much. Apart from that, if you have any questions, leave them down below for the next episode. I do appreciate everyone who left a question over the space of two weeks. We've had some great news. I am confident Title Update 19 is getting more and more better.
features than ever before. I've been Echo. Have a great day, and I'll catch you next time. Bye!